Okay. It's been way too long since I've done this. I'm nervous. Plus, I'm doing it by myself, and I'm not good at that. Um, I guess I'll just talk into the void. Okay. I've been putting this off for a fucking while now. Um, like, I just got home from school very recently. Like, a week, maybe a week and a half ago. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna stream again since it's been way, like, a, a very long time since I've done that. And, like, I talked to my good buddy Kaito about this. Hello, whoever that is in chat. You're my Blue's Clues fanatic. Well, I wanted to change my background from what it was before, which you can check my VODs channel to see what that was. Um, and I thought this would be funny. So it's the Blue's Clues chair now. But I've, like, I've been wanting to stream for so fucking long, but the setup process has been brutal. Like, I s wanted to switch to YouTube just to see how it felt, and it it, uh, it sucked reconfigurating everything. Is that even the right word? Configuring. Reconfiguring everything. Uh, like, I tried OBS out to see how it was. Nothing was working. I went back to Streamlabs, which is what I'm using right now, and... Ugh, fucking nothing was working. Ugh. I... I'm going through it right now. But... I'm just gonna try and forget about my problems. If shit is wrong, I don't care anymore. I'm, I'm past the point where I care. And I'm past the point where I wanted to have already streamed. So I'm just going to do it. And hopefully while I'm home for the winter, I'll do this more regularly. That's probably a lie, but I really am going to try. Because I want to do this more. And I've only done it like four times. So I'm going to start playing the game now. I recently went back and wanted to start replaying Sword and Shield. Um, honestly, purely because... Actually, I didn't connect. Completely honestly... Like, only... Well, not only, but mostly because I wanted to shiny hunt for Rayquaza. But I didn't want to do it on my original save. I always come back. Who the fuck is that? Don't you put FNAF references in my chat. How dare you forget my name? Oh, I do remember your name! Holy shit! Huh. If you're who I think you are, then it's nice to see you back here. That's cool. I'm shiny hunting for Rayquaza right now, which is going to be grueling and very boring. This is going to be a very boring stream. And it's, I'm not used to this. I'm not good at talking. Not when I know people could be watching me. Which, there aren't many at all. But the idea of it still scares me. I was better at this like a year ago. I shouldn't even do for Polytoad. How'd it go? <laughs> I hope you got what you were looking for. Because... Depending on the game, that could have been quite the process. Good? Okay, good. I 
if you play Scarlet and Violet, I recently took advantage of those Deli Bird raids. I forget if it was... To kill a thousand Poliwags? I am so sorry. <laughs> My god. Um, I recently took advantage of those Deli Bird raids, the event in Scarlet and Violet, which I might do the Iron Bundle raids on stream because I wanted to do that and I haven't done it yet and I haven't updated my internet connection since the event started so I'll still have it like active in my game if it's a what when is it over tomorrow right or is it today I fucking forget I don't know um but yeah I got a shiny Delo bird it only took me like 40 that I um got with the auto battle before I found one. The shiny gods have been notoriously good to me. I almost, like, feel guilty about it for some reason. Also, if anyone is currently here, how is my audio? I want to know how my audio is. Are things too loud? Are things too quiet? Should I change anything? Let me know. <laughs> Oh, cool. I was afraid that was going to take a lot longer than I had things to say. Make game audio a little louder? Okay. I made it a little bit louder. And also the latency is fucking terrible. It's somehow a lot worse than how it was on Twitch, but I like YouTube as a platform better, so it's worth it to me. But there is like a full 10 to 20 second delay. It's insane. So I'm sorry if I take long to respond to things. Yeah, there's fucking... I'm not gonna get another two people. But yeah, let's just go. <laughs> Last night I was doing this over and over, and I kept consistently getting four people. I was like, oh, sick, this is awesome. And the, tonight, of course, the night that I'm finally streaming it, it sucks. This is going to go horribly. We did not get good Pokemon for this. I don't know if Pokemon's gonna be that great for a Rayquaza. Um, I'm gonna go for the funny answer. For no reason in particular. Not just so I can see a giant towering low punny. Not at all. Okay, the game is getting a bit louder now, so. Oh. <laughs> what do you mean? What are you talking about? <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's fine. Um, there are better Pokemon like two dynamites for this. So. I'm gonna keep saying this, but it's been way too long. It's gonna be it's gonna be so weird for me to have to concentrate on streaming and also playing the game. Like I'm I'm going to embarrass myself. I swear to God, I'm prefacing this so that people know that I know I look stupid. If it has a fighting type move, though, I am. I'm done. It's over. <laughs> Pokemon. I thought of that. I didn't want to make the joke though. So, <laughs> thanks for doing it for me. Oh, I forgot that the 
NPCs don't Dynamax. <laughs> I was thinking of it like there are four people here, because that's what I'm used to. This is not going well already. That does get damage, though. Those attack boosts are helping a lot, actually. That's good. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I do hope I get a shiny on stream. That would be nice to record. That'd be very nice to record. This is gonna be such a juxtaposition from what the rest of my channel is. Because the rest of my channel is just miscellaneous. Most of it is Friday Night Funkin'. I haven't been playing that as much recently, though. I don't know why. I think it's mostly because I was preoccupied with school, and then I started hyper-fixating really bad on Pokemon. After DLC for Scarlet and Violet came out. So... Anyone who is seeing this from that, or anyone who does see this from that, I should say, because there's only one person here to my knowledge. But like, it's... I don't know how that's going to go over. Should I switch from this? I do genuinely like this law funny. It is good stuff. I'm gonna swap, actually, yeah. Barris. Is that a Barrisquita? I cannot tell. No, that's not. Oh, that's an Excelgore. Why did I say Barrisquita? What the hell is wrong with me? I say this one. Just this the berries that way. Hitmonchan would have been more effective on the... Um, well, actually, I don't know what... I forgot. Is it Bug Dark? Well, fuck if I know. No, it's not. You know, Bounce. I'm gonna use Mega Kick on my turn. And then... Next turn, I'll be able to die max. And I'll be able to use the max air stream instead of having to wait two turns. That sucks, though. At least most of us are physical attackers, but still. Holy shit! Alright, I don't need to fucking dynamax. Are you kidding me? I will, though, just in case. I... Okay, never mind. I actually genuinely do not need to. We will kill it on this turn no matter what. I would in, like, a better safe than sorry scenario, but, like... I'm... Like, it's, it's fine. That's another thing, though, that I will put on record. I am a very cautious video game player. A pussy, one could say. So. Have most of my streams been Pokemon related? I think so, because three of them are Pixelmon. I'm good without it. 
Yeah, three of my streams are fixable. Well, Pokemon is my favorite game, by the way. So, if any, if more people start watching this, that is a lot of what you're gonna see, because that's most of what I do in my free time is just play Pokemon, especially recently. What is that? That's a Linoon. It's a Shinotic. It's a... Uh... None of this is particularly good. I guess we could do this way. For the... Items. I feel bad for that Lilligant, though. Uh... Accuracy. Mercy opposing Pokemon accuracy. I don't have anything that has low accuracy, so I guess I'll just status condition. Yeah, I'll just I'll take the bright powder. I don't think the bright powder has done anything for ever anyone ever, but I will take it on the off chance that it actually does help. I wanted to stream this too is because it's online so if I have more than zero viewers at a time anyone who wants to could join which would be nice I feel like that'd be a lot of fun but the reason like one of the main reasons I'm so self-conscious to do this is because I don't have a chat Like, I wish I had the people, like, at least I'm, like, five people, even. That would be more than enough to consistently respond to and play off of. Because I create best when I'm playing off of other people. I can play off of myself. I mean, I've been talking to myself for the past, what, 15 minutes? But it's, I don't think it's good. It's not good. <laughs> Whenever I'm by myself, I just talk about things like this. Like, oh, I'm so bad at it. All my insecurities. Let me vent on YouTube. But that's honestly what this is for. This is just a decompression strategy so I don't go mentally insane. I hardly even know what's happening in the fucking game. The game is, like, subconscious to me. I should be paying more attention. <laughs> the grassy terrain is nice. Oh, shit. That sucks. That actually sucks. That actually sucks so fucking bad. Are you kidding me? <laughs> All of the items I found, it was the, the grassy seed. have to make myself look pretty for streams. That's too much work. I do want to redo my channel a little bit. Make a new banner, make a new profile picture, make a new little guy. Get a better microphone because it picks up fucking everything. Like it picks up shit from across my house, which, you know, it, it's going to do that. I'm good without it, I think. I can keep the lock running. That's good. I was hoping that would happen. Um, what the fuck was I saying? That's another thing. I get distracted way too fucking easily. <laughs> I... There's the boy. 
literally what I was just talking about before, gone. I don't. Oh right. Yeah, it, it it picks up shit from like across the house, which is just a consequence of living with people. But still, it's insane. That hit him on top and that Excel door is in. Are in, are in some trouble though. Against a legendary flying type. What was the point of that rain dance? I mean, it's a it's an it's a computer, so like I get it, but like. Come on now. Ha! Oh boy! Why did I do that? I think, I think the previous thing we were done. Fair enough. That will actually help. If only somewhat. <sighs> oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, wait, did they take a focus sash? Let's go! CPU actually smart? Holy shit! That's a problem, though. <laughs> That's I'm surprised with the team that we had. We didn't have a death or Oh my god! Okay! <laughs> this went a lot better than I was expecting it to. But yeah, first run already completed. That was fast. Look at that! Remember how everyone was fucking dogpiling on the graphics of Sword and Shield on the Switch? And now we have things like Scarlet and Violet. Like, I love the game. Unironically, I love the game. Um, but... Like, the story? Great. Gameplay? As good as a Pokemon game can get. You know, it's Pokemon. The gameplay's pretty much always going to be the same. But, uh, the performance and the graphics are absolutely dog water. Why? Like, the story was obviously, like, that had some thought in it. Like, that's one of my favorite storylines in any Pokemon game, to be honest. I don't know if that's a hot take or what, but still... But, um, like, everyone thought Sword and Shield was so bad, everyone was talking about the trees, and that, like, you can see the fucking tiling in the mountains in Scarlet and Violet, it's insane! Like, Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee was a smaller game, so that's probably why they were able to make it look a little better more easily, but that did look good. Sword and Shield looked, like, okay. It looked like a 3DS game on the Switch. But a Switch game should have looked better. <laughs> Legends Arceus and BDSP looked great. I thought BDSP looked great. The environments in the battle were especially good. Um, not saying the game itself is great. The graphics by themselves I thought were good. Legends Arceus was a great compromise between graphics and gameplay. Because they did so much. It was like a fucking... Pokemon Renaissance era. But how the fuck did they get to Scarlet and Violet from there? That shit is rushed as fuck. They have to stop crunching like that. Alright, let me actually get to the point of the stream and see if any of this is shiny. No. No. Fuck! Let me do the double check for the sparkles. No. Fuck! I'm gonna take the low punny for the for the the comedic value. No. 
mouth. Get in the box. And would you like to keep this record? Yes. Keep that record. I'm going to be using it for the next couple hours. This is going to be a long night. Especially because I'm just by myself right now. At least we got someone faster than we did last time. Let's see if we can actually get a team of four, though. Or a team of three, at least. Though, the team of two did do surprisingly well. At least the waiting music is groovy, though. <gasps> Third person, let's go! I'm gonna wait until 1.30 to see if another person will come. has the best moves for this but it's fighting type i think i will do mr mine for now that mill tank is good for rayquaza that mill tank is good please someone take that mill tank please please take the mill tank please Okay, great. Pionia got the mill tank. <laughs> right, what is that? Pseudo Udo. I would go that way. But. No, both of them would be super effective on the feet more. So that way is more worth it, I think. Or I could just be stupid. But I knew that already, so. Is my audio good? Because the game got louder than it was before. So I don't know if... Like, my audio will be too drowned out by the game. Um... I guess I'll put up a reflect. Just cause. Cause they got it. And I believe Sudoru is an attacker. I could be wrong. Ah, fuck. thing you could have hit. Well, Tank, I think, is the bulkiest one that we have here. That sucks, though. The Sandstorm is going to be so annoying.
I didn't even pay attention to who's Dynamaxing right now. What Pokemon is Dynamaxing? The Heat Ball. Okay. That's probably for the best. Because it's the one that needs the most. Uh, health. One needs to be the tankiest. Okay. Honestly, not much more than default damage. That's nice. That is actually very nice. You have max overgrowth. Okay. That is actually very nice. And now we'll have grassy terrain, which will negate the sandstorm damage. That's perfect. do that much, but it's something. Yeah. Not too much. That's good. Greatest fears in video games is pressing the wrong button in a menu. So I always like have a split second where I spaz, and I'm like, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. But that's like amplified by a thousand when I'm being, when, like, I'm not being watched by that much ever. But why did I? <laughs> having a stroke. Hold on. Um, it's amplified with the idea of being watched by people. Because I don't want to press the wrong button when I'm trying to make content. Because that sucks. Also, both of these options are going to suck for me. But the heat more and the Mian Shao should carry us through the Obama Snow. So I just have to be really careful. I think I'll be okay. I hope I'll be okay. We'll see how this goes. This ankle pseudo Udo kind of looks like a penis. I'm not used to much. If I stay for this long, I'm gonna save it. When I say penis, I mean like porn penis, you know? Like the penis in porn that you see where you're like, oh, it's kind of weird. You know? But like it's curved, it's just like the weird angle. It's like, is he gonna get it in? Like, that looks like it would hurt. I think I should be diagnosed as clinically insane.
I remember this being a lot easier. Than Holy shit. I remember this being a lot easier. Than I mean, I'm going to stream to picture myself. Oh, sick. This is going a lot better than I, I thought it would. Let me not jinx myself, though. <laughs> Because I have quite the track record when it comes to fucking up in general. Okay, we're good. Also, related to my mic picking up everything, sorry if you hear a lot of shuffling. It's the ADHD. If I knew how to... like, set up... noise cancelling... I would. But I don't, so. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> We're gonna roll with what we got. Aurora Veil is really nice, actually. Though, I would rather someone else take it. Because we're fighting a Rayquaza. Please don't let Peonia. Is it Peonia or Peonia? I never knew. Please don't let Peonia take that Obama snow. <laughs> Thank Christ. Okay. Um, that one would be okay. That one would go well. Who's that electric one? I can't tell. I would go for that one. Because two of us have shit that's super effective. And one of us is supposedly pretty bunky. Uh, bunky. Bulky. I think Obama's nose is supposed to be bulky. It looks like it is anyway. Like that fool. Give him that bombastic side eye. When was the last time I'd heard that meme? Why did I just have the compulsion to say that? That actually kind of sucks. point of that it's just gonna recover from it every turn and it's fast so it's not like it's gonna like we're not faster than it enough for the lowering of speed from paralysis to do much okay cool that's the end of that also i just registered i got two accelerators it's weird In a row, I encountered two Excel cores. Yeah. 
I think we should just stay with the team that we have, honestly. This team is pretty okay. I spent, like, all day yesterday completing the Galar decks just to get the Shiny Charm so that I could do this on stream and have the increased rates. Remember when this was first going around, the increased shiny rates, and every, like, every single thumbnail was just like, ONE IN 25 ODDS! <laughs> it's like, that's not actually how that works, but okay. you again. Please don't miss. Mm. I hope this goes well. I wonder what moves... So I know that he has a fire type move and a grass type move. He might have used another move that I forgot that he had. But we'll see how this goes. That's guard. Huh. That actually did, like, not that bad damage. And the paralysis is nice. Ah, my s fucking stone edge hit. Let's go. Oh my god. I love wrecking shop. Oh, the grassy terrain. I didn't think of that. That's not good. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, that actually really, really sucks. I take back my comment about Wrecking Shop. Nice. Will mine do anything? Oh shit, cool. You had play rough in the back pocket and didn't use it? Oh, let's fucking go! Let's see if this one is shiny. My big black serpent paws. Like Pause was one of my top, top, top favorite Pokemon. Like top three, I think. Maybe top five. And its shiny is also just one of my favorites. It's, it's so fucking good. Almost no shadow war. Fuck! Let me double check. Yeah. No dice. What did I take last time? The Bopany. I have an Excelgor. Do I have a Pseudo Wudo? I think I do. I'm pretty sure I have all of these, but I don't want to take the Rayquaza. 
because then I can't shiny hunt for it anymore. So. Oh, get in the box. You will be a junk Pokemon forever. to stop caring so much because me being so self-conscious to stream is actually causing my brain not to process things which is the reason i'm so self-conscious about streaming i don't want people to see me not processing things so let's just do this so much and just be me naturally. Come on. At least one more person show up. Notice that the BPM of the song is matched up to the the timer. Must be like 120. That's fun. Oh, we got someone else. All right, yeah, let's just go. Damn, Gigantamax Grimsnaw. This would be good. That would also be good. Eh. Ooh, I'm going to stump this couple with my gut. The Sand Slash is nice. The Ice one. Yes. Aw. I wish the computer took that cleft key. Oh shit, a fly on. Damn. Hi. Alright, which way are we going? Um I say the flag on. Because collectively, I think we do a lot better on that one.
Oh, fuck. I forgot that's its ability. So close. You close? You close? Fly dots close. Not be worth the switch. Mm. Yeah, fuck it. Let's see. We'll see if that was a terrible decision or not. Um, you could do this one. I say that one, I guess. It's gonna fuck up Patricia, but let's hope that it's not so um taxing on this run. okay because I don't want to be drowned out by the game and I don't want the game to be too quiet also uh, let's see it must have sucks doesn't it I'll get the accuracy lowering at least I might miss some moves because <laughs> mudslap is very annoying Power up punch. It's dope. That's not as dope. Okay, we this might have been a bad idea actually. We are not doing like anything. But I can Dynamax now. It'll raise our special defense. Good because the next room might have special moves. Depending on the move set that it <laughs> gave. I swear to god, if I go back and look at this and my audio is like super shit. Like, I know it's gonna be shitty. Like, it's amateur. But, like, if it's, like, super shit, I'm gonna be pissed at myself for going through all of that effort and stress to get myself to stream. And not having it go that well.
What? Did something happen? I don't... Did I miss? Or did... No, I hit it. I just forgot that I did. Jesus Christ, I swear to God, I'm developing dementia. I'm so mentally ill, man. Oh. It's already even been an hour away. Am I already tired? Alright, I've hardly eaten today. Oh, dope. Hopefully that actually pays off if we get to that turn. We won't. Let's catch it stay. Luxor is also in my top ten favorite Pokemon. It's been one of my favorites since I played my first Pokemon game, which was Platinum. I always try to catch Shinx in a Premier Ball, because that's what I caught it in originally. I don't know why I have such a vivid memory of doing that, but I, that's what I did. Um, I think I'll be okay. Hmm. Huh. Ha. Huh. Will be super effective on this. Here too, but yeah, I think it'd be safer to go this way. We're not gonna get any items though, which kind of sucks. So I hope that that Grim Snarl makes it out alive. It would really suck if it didn't. <laughs> Oh yeah, Mudslap is still super effective. Fuck it. It's not gonna be doing much, but it'll do something. For fuck's sake, I forgot that's an ability that it gets. Oh, wow. The damage actually is pretty good. Oh, fuck yeah. We are fucking this thing. Oh, holy shit. I'm surprised it wasn't a Gengar. It's like this is the... The final bit of the game. You think everything would be fully evolved by now, right? that Grim Snarl makes it out. I really hope that we can tough out this one. This is getting a little perilous. <laughs> that 
That's what this music reminds me of. It sounds like a track in Xenoverse 2. Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Also one of my favorite games of all time. Third time's the charm. I didn't do as much as I would have liked to do. Okay. Oh, good shit. Would it be worth it to do that? Yes. <laughs> it lowers his attack. That would be good. And I think I'm faster than it, maybe? I might not be. I don't remember the turn order. Even though the last turn was literally, like, five fucking seconds ago. Not great. That did not do nearly as much as I would have wanted it to. Flygon is supposed to be an attacker, what the fuck? do as much as the last one. Was the last one a crit? Or did something change about the battlefield or something? I don't know. What the hell? Oh my god. Thank Christ. The computer was dumb. We love a we love a himbo computer. I was about to click don't catch. I was gonna be pissed. I was gonna be so pissed at myself. so loud I scared myself, but still, I'm pissed. Why am I so impatient? Uh oh, the ADHD. <laughs> that was genuine, by the way. <laughs> I was like, it's only been three runs. Why am I already getting so impatient? I know why. <laughs> oh, shit. I got dumped into a lobby with three other people already. At least that skips the weight. Nice.
I guess I'll go with the sand slash and hope for the best. It's either me or the Dracloak. that bug is good on dark and I forgot that sense slash had a bug type move. <laughs> good shit. Hopefully I can get it off before that crooked it out fucking one shots me. With my luck. Terrain does besides negate dragon type moves, but whatever. Weird. Oh shit! That did more damage than I thought it would. I am pleased. So, if we're the ones that set up the Misty Terrain, does that mean that we can use Dragon-type moves, but they can't? Because I thought that Dragon-type moves were negated on all sides. Isn't it like that in Scarlet Violet? I feel like I remember that being a thing during the Charizard raids. But like, a thing that I remember seeing during the Charizard raids, I mean. And this is still only the fucking first raid battle. I feel like so much more time has passed since. I'm actually getting like surprisingly tired right now. I might end stream after this, even though it's only been an hour and a half. I'm out of practice and fuel. But then the stream would be so fucking boring. Like I just did four runs trying to shine him for a Rayquaza while I talked like an idiot about random shit that does not matter. Not funny at all. And I keep looking over at my fucking chat window like anyone is even here. Frame rate has decreased. Um, I think we'll do better on this one. All 
right, I'm gonna have to try to hold my own as a ground type against water and flying. It's not the best matchup, but. Sand Slash is a good Pokemon, so I'm hoping I can pull this off. Oh, I've got Stone Edge! I want to save that for Rayquaza, though, so I'm going to use Crush Maybe a bad idea. Might regret it later. We'll see. We're good. I think we're good. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think... Just maybe, I think we're good. I'm also starting to stream it fucking... I started streaming it. What? What time was it? 7.30 around? After having eaten, like, a meal all day and severely dehydrated, I can take care of myself way better. Before I start going on about, oh, I'm not energy, oh, I'm not funny. Yeah, after this run, I'm ending stream. And... I will try to get myself to come back tomorrow, because I do want to. What the fuck? Okay. My stream lost connection for a second. I panicked. <laughs> I hard panicked. I'm good without it. Let us keep going! What's up next on the shopping block? So beware, Toxtricity, Skarmory. No fucking clue what everyone shows. Oh no, are they gonna bank on me? <laughs> Alright. Let's see if I Dynamax this turn. Oh shit, it's a Gigantamax Toxicity. That's dope. If the Rayquaza isn't shiny, I'm taking this. This is actually something I've been wanting, because I failed to catch a uh, Gigantamax Toxtricity before. Good, I can Dynamax. Um, and I wanted to look for one to get one back, but I just didn't have the patience to do that. At the time, at least. But if we beat this, then I know I can at least get this. So. That's good, at least. <sighs> Sentra's cute. I'm the kind of guy that, like, thinks every single animal is cute, no matter what animal it is. Except for, like, a like a select few. Like, the blobfish. Like, yeah, it's ugly. That's, like, the whole bit, or whatever. Ooh, good damage. Um. Which shiny should I next time? Gen 7, but not only because the... Oh my god, I just one-shot this thing. Holy shit. Um, Gen 7 Pokemon only? Let's see. 
Um, where are you doing it on? Is this on Sun and Moon? Mostly. Hmm. Oh, sick berries. Uh, Ultra Sun. Ooh. If you have access to Ultra Space, then why not Shiny Hunt a Legendary or Mythical? That'd be fun. If not, though, then Salandit and Salaz will have good shinies. And I personally like uh, Alolan Sandslash's shiny, even though it's just a different shade of blue. For me, it adds something. So that's my input. Ian is playing Fortnite, that's crazy. I forgot that that would be picked up on stream, that's actually kind of funny. Also, oh god. That's really not great. That's good though. And the Misty Terrain will actually help. Force does decent damage. Oh my lord, Stone Edge. Oh my goodness gracious. Let's see if I can hit that shit again. Um, if you're still here, out of the Scarlet Violet decks, which Pokemon should I shiny hunt next? Aw, oh, that's not great. through. Hopefully we can pull this off. And our closet isn't full of random bullshit. Okay, good. Great. Wish me luck. is going to vibrate and the mic is going to pick it up. It's probably annoying. Is that person still here? That's really embarrassing if not. Yeah. No shiny. So I'll take the Toxtricity. Yeah, that person's not still here anymore. <laughs> that is real. <laughs> I was just talking to myself. They just came in to ask what shiny Pokemon they should hunt and then left. That's funny.
you know what? Having that extra person just come in last minute did actually give me some extra motivation. I don't know why. I am going to pause stream for a little bit, but I will be back, I think.
Okay, I was afraid my stream was going to disconnect again. <laughs> Ugh, we are so fucking back. <sighs> I just took a minute to refuel. I had some leftovers I had in my fridge. Let's fucking do this. I'm pumped now. I drank caffeine. I'm going to be fucking insane. At least I hope I am. Because that's what I want for my stream. <coughs> Fuck. I had an epiphany while I was gone. Maybe my first stream <coughs> coming back shouldn't have been one of the most boring and monotonous things that I like to do. Especially since I wasn't used to doing this. Oh shit, cool. Alright, I got four people. Oh, look at that. They both got two Z's at the end of their name. Maybe they're brothers. Maybe they're lovers. The world may never know. That wasn't an incest joke, by the way. I want to make that very clear. <clears throat> Unless they're stepbrothers, and it's fine. Which one of them do you think would get stuck in the washing machine? The business guy. Definitely the business guy. He looks like the guy that would <clears throat> get stuck because he's like prim and proper and like minus the hair traditionally attractive and you know the camera guy is always you know you know all right let's see what we got here oh please someone take that fucking whimsicott let's fucking go it's weak to the flying type but it's got player rough which is pretty good I hope I can snack something okay. <coughs> oh my fucking god. I'm taking that tentacruel. My nose is clogged. The leftovers I ate were a little spicy. And my body has terrible spice resistance. Huh? go this way like I can I myself can handle spice it's just that anything spicy that I eat my nose will immediately start to clog up it's so annoying fucking shit <laughs> no the whimsicott is going to die that whimsicott's time is up <laughs> The joke is really obvious, but I'm not going to make it. That's... Nah. Those jokes got old three years ago. Uh, should I go for... No. <laughs> I shouldn't risk it. In one turn, I could get smacked off of the face of the earth entirely. Hurricane? Huh. I are like I already forgot what moves we all have. Ah shit, that sucks. <laughs> A move like that is like the worst move to have that effect happen to you. Ugh, okay, that's not ideal, but I'll take it. Or was that sword stance very quiet? <laughs> oh, this kid's got Leon's haircut. What Pokemon is 
is this? The Frost Lass, okay. Let's hope it wakes up. <laughs> I really hope it wakes up. Hurricane hits twice in a row? Banger. Fuck! Now I'm asleep. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Shit. Damn. What the fuck? Where did he pull psychic fangs from? I don't. I don't remember. Oh shit! Okay. So if we can get rid of this thing before it gets it attacks off. Uh, am I about to eat my own goddamn words? I sure am. At least eat it to me, and not the person that's actually doing the good damage. I reiterate, we love a himbo CPU. Uh, get in the ball, sus guy. Right moves. I'm okay without it. As long as I wake up, <laughs> I'll be okay without it. What path? Uh oh. I don't know. I feel like we do better with the Hitmon Lee, considering we have a fairy type and a ghost type. And someone with the psychic type move. That has swords dance. <laughs> Though the replacement Pokemon would have been would have been nice. Tentacool an attacker or a special attacker? I don't know. I should have looked that up. I know you're going to be able to hear this on stream, so I apologize, but I am indeed compulsively rocking back and forth in my chair. the, for anyone who is watching this, that is the very slight creaking that you may hear, may or may not hear. Oh, it's not that great, but at least it's a <laughs> defense we're gonna go down, or defense and special defense. Oh, shit. All right. Dope. Down. 
I feel like I'd be funny over the webcam. Because I'd like... Because when I'm not doing anything... Like, I could... Like, it, it feels more like I'm talking to someone. Because I know that someone on the other end could see me. I will swap. <laughs> Purely for my health. Mm. Ooh. Let's go with that one. Because we've got a fairy type and a fighting type. Ghost type, not so much. I will say. But... Actually, we could have gone the Slow King way. And I would have been sacrificed, but they would have been fine. Because we've got a Grass type, a Ghost type. Eh, too late now. My selfish desires have once again gotten the best of me, but I'm used to that. Let's go, big dog. He thinks he's got that dog in him. Let's see if he's right. Uh, I will die to that. What the fuck? Why is it 95 and 85? What the hell is that? Stage attack Greedon. Do Dynamax moves take two PP? If they do, I just noticed that. Got the Hurricane off again! Three for three! That Whimsicott is doing something else. Nice. The triple axle to finish it off, no pause. A shiny Absol would be dope. The first max raid I did, after getting the shiny charm, I got a shiny. Now, every other one since then has not yielded one, which, you know, yeah, it's like 1 in 300 and something odds for each one, which equates to 1 in 25 or something, technically. But still. Oh, it has Blizzard! I'm taking that shit. I want that shit, and I want it now. Because I will get fucked up by that Rayquaza. Sick. I hope I'm not being selfish, but... We have a pretty okay team. That Whimsicott is going to be a glass cannon. So let's hope it gets to fire before Rayquaza does. I say a lot about it. While I'm gay, so that tracks, I guess. Though, so, for anyone who's seen past streams of mine, you'd know that. Let's go with the blizzard. Let's hope it hits. Oh, the Whimsicott's Dynamaxing. Let's go. Hopefully that serves us good.
Oh, why did I not notice that? Rayquaza's Rings Club. I think I did, and I just never really acknowledged it. Okay, that's a good chunk. I like that. I like that. Alright, alright. Ooh. Oh, big damage. Let's go. And that was a crit, too. Oh, and I got the blizzard off. Let's go. And it's frozen! You know? Yeah, we're kind of just the dream team right here, I think. And this is peak. This is my peak right now. The triple axel kills it, I think. Yeah. I didn't see a world where that didn't. Unless it missed about him, but the triple axel can miss. Let's get this thing in a ball. Genron, grant my wish to be shiny. I mean, like, the simulators are kind of uncanny. Like, it's a green sort of dragon that comes from the sky. That is, twig arms. But obviously it can't current wishes because it's not shiny. So, I'm going to take the Absol. Because I like Absol. So apparently I didn't have it in my decks. Give me another Rayquaza. On oh, nice. I was about to start doing a bit back and forth with myself. It would have been the cringiest thing I've ever done. I could not let myself be seen on camera. Recorded, rather. I could not let myself be recorded doing shit like that. <sighs> I swear, when I'm actually, like in a good headspace, like when I'm actually taking care of myself and my brain is normal, I'm a completely different person. Like this is not who I just was 30 minutes ago. <laughs> that BRB was the best thing to happen to me today. Cause I had no appetite all day, but of course midway through when I'm trying to stream, I start getting extremely tired and sluggish and hungry and fatigued. And I'm like, do I stop streaming or should I just BRB? Then that last person came in. Rumi912. I will never forget that name. <laughs> They're long gone. But seeing another person in chat motivated me. And I'm back. I'm so back. Did the person just join and immediately leave? Actually? What the fuck, dude? Rude. Oh, we got someone else. Hopefully they stay. <laughs> Please. I know we've only got two of us, but please. 
dragon type lovers stick together, please. <laughs> Oh, let's go. Oh my god. What are the fucking odds? Oh, if you couldn't tell by now, my name is Donovan. It's not really that big a deal. Name reveal. It's a fucking nobody. Um, hmm. I will take... The Marowak. Nidoqueen Queen is also a good option. Especially the Scorching Sands. It's a good move. Gigantamax Kingler. Hmm. That's good shit, too. Oh, the Icy Wind. Oh, they literally just took every Pokemon that I was fawning over. This is, like, perfect. Oh, there's a little Fairy type, too. I wonder what it is. A poison type damage dealer. Huh? What's that normal type though? I can't tell. I really can't tell what that is. Oh shit, it's a Gigantamax Alchemy! That's good shit. This is the second time I've gotten one of those on a Rayquaza raid. It's pretty lucky. Ooh. Might as well, right? If I can get the max steel spike off. Get this thing out of the way quick. This ain't the kind of cake I like to look for. And pause. I hate to do that. Anyone who's watching this and just watched me say that, I never talk like that, unironically. That was not real. Dope. It sucks. What's with that? What does decorate do? Because it just throws my attack and special attack sharply. Does that do anything for the alchemy? Oh, dope. Our defense rose, too. Like, what purpose does decorate serve? Offensively. Does it at all? Because if not, then it's really silly that the fucking max raid Pokemon can have it. Get crap smacked. Oh shit. I just got crap smacked. Grassy terrain is nice though, but. Did I go yet? I don't know if I. No, I didn't. Okay. Grassy terrain don't matter. <laughs> There's a crit too, but. <laughs> that matter didn't matter either. It's a little overkill. Oh, I forgot that I was gonna be stopped. I actually, going to do that. I'll do it off stream. After that, go into a fucking store. Oh, that's why that sword stance was quiet before. I had my audio set to stereo. It must have been in my left ear, because I have my left ear out to make sure that I'm not being too loud. Because I still live with my parents. I want to swap. Let me swap. The, Mar the Marowak only got that last crit because it knew I was going to try and replace him. Hmm. 
neither option is that great. But I say this way purely for the scientist. Because both ways the Mr. Mime is going to be effective on. Though... The Nido Queen and the Kingler would have been super effective on the fire. But fire resists mine moves, and then Mr. Mine would be screwed. And I can't let a, a fellow Donovan just get screwed like that. But to be, he's about to get screwed again with the Pulte guys. <laughs> so. the masterpiece version in the max rate battles that'd be neat shot the raises like decorating yeah it's just that i'm gonna decorate somebody but i don't know who would be the best person to do that Let's do it to the Needle Queen, since she's gonna Dynamax. Might as well help the process along, yeah? But I try to get off of my teammate target. Got a good setup going. We got the light screen. We got the decorate. Oh well, I couldn't get the decorate before. <laughs> it got a move off. That sucks. Oh, its defense fell. Oh my god. That shit just got the crabs. I just had another stroke. That's gonna happen pretty often. Uh oh. Ooh. Okay. More than I wanted it. Less than I expected. But what I was going to say, that thing just got crab smacked. I don't know if I'd be wasting my turn here. Oh, look at that. That's my... That's my doing. That's what it was. He crab smacked the shit out of the Poltegeist. That was the sentence I was trying to say. It took me three tries and like a full minute to think of what I wanted to say before I actually got it out right. Oh, right, the backpack is there, too. I didn't see that. Nice, I was hoping it'd be Gigantamax. Gigantamax Butterfree was all I saw in Gigantamax raids in my original playthrough. I have not seen a single Gigantamax Butterfree raid in this most recent playthrough. 
Oh fuck, I have mystical fire? Oh yeah. Though the Gigantamax Butterfree seems to be too much for my Switch to handle because it is dropping frames. <laughs> Crabhammer does so much fucking damage, like, Jesus. Oh, fuck. I forgot that bug is gone, Psychic. That did more damage than I thought it would. And its special attack fell? Oh, I thought it meant me. <laughs> when it said Donovan and Dynamax. But it would have shown the animation, so why'd I think that? Sick, nice. The, the fucking max raids give the most absurd moves to the Pokemon options they give you. Look, I didn't even know that Needle Queen could get ghost coverage, let alone special attack ghost coverage. Also, two Gigantamax Pokemon and one Max Raid. It's pretty good. I believe... Yeah. We're on to the final hurdle. Fifth time's the charm. <laughs> this is a move. Restores his own HP. I could use Life Orb. Because I think next is my turn to Dynamax. So I could get some really, really big damage off. Even though Life Orb is kind of shitty sometimes. I don't know why I love Pokemon so much when I'm just genuinely not good at it. I suck at Pokemon. Especially for Pedal. Yeah, I can Dynamax. Alright, let's see what I can do. G Max finale. Let's go. I'm trying to fuck this thing up. I want me my shiny goddamn red closet. And I want it now. Where's the shiny anything, really? Something shiny would be really cool to get on stream. Ooh! It always uses Brutal Swing, too. Good setup here. They're all just setting up for me. Holy shit. Thanks, guys. Banger team. Dream team right here. From the beginning, this team has been great. Oh, right. It heals up my teammates, too. I forgot about that.
Dude, that Gengar sweater is so stupid. I love it. I want that in real life. I would so wear that. Oh! Oh! You know? Oh shit, let's go. Nice, nice. Dang. We're really laying into this thing. I'm honestly surprised it. Oh, yeah, it's not good. I'm honestly surprised you didn't go for crab hammer again. Holy fuck, it took two turns. Damn. This is the best run I've had yet. It started out a little bit rough, got a lot better very fast. If this one is the shiny one, the big peak. Peak streaming moment. Besides Garden Ban Ban, of course. Alright, I'll take the Butterfree, so I can have a Gigantamax Butterfree in my boxes. That's the good thing about this too, even if you don't get the thing that you want, you can still get something. I feel bad for this scientist lady, I just keep chugging along trying to find this one legendary. And I keep making her jot down notes over and over and then immediately going back out just to come back again to make her jot down more. She's really putting in the work for me. Oh my god. Oh, I think that's the kid that fucking... Zack, that's the kid that left and came back. Now look. That would be good for the Combuskin and the Noctowl, but not for the Grimmsnarl. And that's a Luxray. Oh, it's a Frost Moth, too. Yeah, we're going this way. Frost, Frost Moth sucks. I like Frost Moth personally. Competitively, it sucks. Maxing, yeah, we got this in the back. I always hate being confident like that because I know immediately uh, proceeding that something bad is going to happen, probably. But would make for a fun stream. I wish you got to keep the rental Pokemon that you chose it first, too. Like you had that option. Oh, 
it didn't do as much as I thought it would. The sunny day is gonna help that, though. Did I get the echoed voice off? I was not even paying attention. Yes, I did. It's good that we got the frost moth to sleep, too. Why do the runs of Pokemon always have the worst fucking attacks for their highest attack stat? Oh my god. Like, Pokemon that are so blatantly just, like, heavy physical attackers will have special attacks. And it's like, what the fuck am I supposed to do with this? Frostmoth's Ice type would do good for Rayquaza, but it's kind of weak in the dark typing. Not that great. Though Ice does resist flying, I think. So we'll see. Or wait, did Sky attack? No! Ice doesn't resist flying, the only thing that Ice resists is itself, which is dumb. It doesn't even have a nice move. <laughs> I'm good without it. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah. We're going this way. Easiest choice. Plus we get an item too. I'm fully evolved so that wouldn't... with a move that it's weak to. I'll go with the shell, though. I'm glad it's not like a pool that you have to pick from and you each get a, your own choice of five randomly selected items. That's nice. Get a shiny, I know what I'm picking. Gen 3 starters is one of my favorite batches. Though that is a basic take. Oh my god. That is doing a lot more damage than I thought it would. Got it under half its health in one turn at a triple axle. Why would you... Why would... Why? Out of all the moves that you had, the grass type one? the, like, the Dynamax size Pokeballs that were just able to huck them like that. Like, teenagers are just able to do that. Did the Grimmsmall not take an item? I wonder why. Did they just get items that shit? Is that a Carnivine? No, it's a Shiner Tick. Uh, Carnivine isn't even in this game, I don't think. I think we do best going this way. Yeah, plus we got the Scientist too, paying us to switch. Mm 
No. Huh. I wonder why the combustion switched. So we could have the Shino taken it and they could have taken it. For the Rayquaza. Because either either Pokemon would have been weak to flying. But at least the Shinotic has super effective stab. <laughs> YouTube says I currently have a singular viewer, so if that is actually true, how is my audio? <laughs> Shit. Oh my god, that was so much health! We would have killed it! It's got Moon Blast. Okay. I'm good with that because the Munchlax wants to take it. Alright, let's see. 
the sixth final showdown today, I believe. sounded like one of those noises that you would like one of those oh mysterious noises that were found deep in the ocean like you know those kinds of things that's what Gig the dynamax china tip cry sounds like oh my god I'm always astounded by how much damage Dragon Ascent does. I forget how powerful that thing is. Ooh, good shit. Is this one gonna be the one? Let's find out! Moth. We got the girl vial. We got the shiny. That's that's not shiny. It looks off, but that's not shiny. I don't think. And just beat the lighting. I think I'm just used to only seeing them in Dynamax battles. Yeah. I will take the girl vial. That was what I planned. I don't know why I had to stew on that. In the box. Oh, I could send out the Scarlet Violet for my decks. I think I'm gonna do that. I apologize to, to anyone who is watching this far in that I am so unapologetically gassy. That was fast.
they're all grass type. The game really wants us to take a fucking grass type with us, huh? What was that one in the middle? It was huge. Uh, the water one, right? Yeah. It's our best bet. What? <laughs> it's got an electric and a grass type. Oh, it's water flying. Was I put into someone else's? I forget. I was the leader of this one. Okay, so I can Dynamax get off a psychic type move. Go home, ha ha ha, I'm so funny. I didn't read what that said. I know it said something about psychic terrain. But I wish I did because I don't know what psychic terrain does. Oh fuck! I am very surprised that I didn't kill. Fuck! If you didn't use drain punch, I would have killed him. God damn it! Missing anything. What the fuck does Topsy Turvy do? Isn't that Inkay's signature? Look at Reverse's stats or something. Why does the physical attacker have Focus Blast? Focus Blast sucks anyway. <laughs> Just put Drain Punch on your fighting types. Oh, it's an Aurora! Amora and Aurorus. It's an Aurorus. <laughs> Do we have the resources to beat that thing? I don't know. We're going for it anyway. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> because it would be very nice to have on our team. Though I don't know if we're going to be able to do that well getting it.
I don't know what Steel Roller does, so if it doesn't affect him or it doesn't do that much damage, I'm sorry. I didn't check to see what it did. I just saw that it said super effective, and I was like, cool. <laughs> What's with the mud slaps, dude? It did a lot more than I was expecting it to. Good shit. And the attack buff, too. It fa yeah, it failed. Okay, so I am just dumb. I should check what the move does. While d oh. It only works on terrain. I didn't know that. Oops. Just barely. Fuck. I keep wanting to make references to other streamers that I like, but I... Like, to people that don't know them, I'm just gonna sound really, really stupid. Like, more than usual. And I don't wanna do that. Someone should switch. I think the Serena or the Lyman should switch to that Aurora. Especially the Lyman, because it's low on health. Okay, or the... One that I didn't say. I really think that lining should. Really... Skarmory or Carcoal? I'm going to perish. Well, we all are, I think. If we had to deal with that Carcoal. So. Skarmory it is. If I were to edit this, I'd put the Opila Bird jump scare sound over that. Oh shit, I've got fucking nothing. Or a special defense. Sure, why not? <laughs> My moves aren't gonna do that much, so I might as well just help with the setup. <laughs> I don't think any of our moves are gonna do that much, actually. We might have been screwed either way. Never mind, it has weak armor. So, the speed buffs may... Uh-oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. 
Oh no. Okay. No. This isn't gonna go that well. This might be the the first L of the stream. Damn, Thunder? It did have that. I remember seeing that. I don't want a Dynamax. It's not going to do anything. This Burpee Metal harshly lowers the target's special defense. I don't know what my ability is, so I don't know if that's going to be a good idea. And I don't know if I can check my own summary. <laughs> Holy shit. Sounds are helping. Uh oh. Oh my god. I'm surprised that didn't kill, and I'm surprised it didn't use it on the Serena. Two debuffs? Am I tripping or did I get two debuffs? Like, for one attack, I mean. Whatever. Oh no. Why did you use it on the one that would resist you? And the Serena got the KO. Did they put Skarmory in Scarlet Violet? Because if so, I'm going to shiny hunt that. At least I want to. Skarmory looks like a Pokemon that should have a good shiny, so I hope it is good. Because I don't... I If I've seen it, I forget what it looks like. That Lining should swap. Please tell me the Lining swaps here. What the fuck? Why? Leftovers is good. I do only have physical attacks. Yeah, that would be good to heighten the power of my attacks. I'm pretty sure Bronzong is a special attacker. I'd be surprised if it wasn't. But even so, both of my moves are physical attacks, so it would help either way.
Oh, well, that's not great. That's... Oh, but it makes the attack fall, off, so... Hmm. The only time when Ancient Power is actually the best move to use. It's a very rare moment. Should I Dynamax? Because I don't think that I should. Because the, if the Aurorus gets the chance to Dynamax, that would be ideal. Because both of its types are super effective on the Rayquaza. Oh shit, nice. We got the heal cheer. Body slam super effective. Why did I? Oh, I guess that's an effective twister. I guess. But why was body slam super effective? Isn't body slam just a normal type move? Or is that like an ability or an item? Aurora's has that makes it super effective. I mean, I'm not complaining. Obviously. But that's just confusing me. just for the overkill. I respect it. Um, I hope this is a common opinion, because it should be. Gen 6 fossils are the best fossils. Aside from Lord Helix, of course. But you can't beat Tyrantrum and an Aurorus. Those two are, like, the most banger fossil Pokemon I've ever seen. I almost pressed Don't Catch. Again. It's the second time I've almost pressed Don't Catch on the thing that I did the, the goddamn raid for. I would have been so mad at myself. Because I, ac I have accidentally pressed Don't Catch before. In a raid. And I was pissed at myself. Alright, let's see if we got anything this time. Got blocked. Aurorus. Skarmory. In a non shiny Rayquaza. <laughs> I'll take the Aurorus. Because I like Aurorus. As one could guess. I really want to get a shiny before I leave stream. Oh shit, cool.
Like, obviously it doesn't have to be Rayquaza. It's going to take a while for me to get Shiny Rayquaza, of all things. Because I get one roll every, like, 20-ish minutes. I would take that Amolda. That Amolda doesn't look too bad, actually. Oh, Combuskin. If only I could take the Pokemon that I pick at the beginning. Why Focus Blast? Um, fuck it. Why not? Blaze against my favorite Pokemon. I always trust my boy. <gasps> There's a blaze again! Please, please, can we do the blaze again? My god, please. Please, please, for the love of god, please. Fuck! Ah! Oh. Would have been so nice to have a blaze again in my fucking sword and shield game. Especially on the off chance of the shiny one. That'd be sick. Though this one is easier because I'm super effective. And I'm sure the sand slash has a rock type move. Because every sand slash I've seen has had a rock type move. I've seen some streamers have, like, PNG tuber avatars like the one that I have. But respond to, like, the tone of their voice. Like, change the look. Like, their emotion changes. I wonder how that works, and if I can do that. Because that'd be really cool, but it would be a lot of work. But it gives me something to do while I'm home. Everything. This. Oh, nice. Literally one turn. That's all it takes. What's that ground type? Needle Queen? Looks like. Two of us are weak to it, but that fairy type is good to have for Rayquaza. Oh wait, no, I'm not weak to it, because fire resists fairy. So it's just the Dredagon. But Dredagon is pretty good. So. I hope we'll be okay. It might have life do though, which would fucking suck. Damn. 
should I take this? Eh. Nah. The mystical fire is nice. I'll be okay. I want to see what else they have to offer up next before I... What's that one that's... Oh, blue full on. Is that wheezing? I want that one. Considering no one loses too much health, I want to take this as much as I can. more damage than I thought it would. I didn't pay attention to how much damage you did last time. I was getting back to someone. That should go well. I would hope so. The only way it wouldn't is if it missed. Alright. That Dredagon should probably switch. Because it's weak to it like me. But it's on much lower health. But if it doesn't switch, then I will. So I'll wait for that Mason's answer. Okay, I'll swap them. <laughs> okay. Oh, cool, we get items. Focus Ash. Short MPP. Boost defense and electric terrain. Slightly boosted. I don't have any super if I didn't notice. Alright, Focus Ash is. Does that Rayquaza could fuck me up? Check it. 
this thing would be the best. Oh, the same thing as Max Rockwell. Yeah, forgot about that. I hope that he makes one to be able to utilize it to its fullest potential. Great. That's good, though. Oh my god. Oh no. We are not doing that thing to this thing. That's not good at all. At all at all. There is no shot that the Dredagon on an 8th HP took a life orb. Like, are we serious? Are you serious right now? Oh, cool. Dang, that means that dual wing beat it did before was life orbed. That's crazy. I said, don't pull any shit out of your ass. Why did you just get two attacks at the beginning of your turn? Hello? Oh. We take these. been grinding too hard. I'm getting a little sleepy. Again. Alright, let's see what we got here. That sucks. I wish I had that shiny that I got the other day. Like, not the other day, literally yesterday, recorded. Are you getting it from the max raid? I'm gonna show it off anyway. Uh, where would it be? Where art thou? There you are. That's not you, actually. 
I lied. You? Yeah. Look at my boy. Look at my boy. I named him Millennium. Because that's a Godzilla reference. And I like Godzilla. I'm a huge nerd for Godzilla. I got this in the max rate. I did I record me getting it? I'm like actually curious. Why did I just take this random capture? <laughs> what the fuck? What was this? I took this literally earlier today. Now I'm just looking through my captures. I got so sidetracked. Such an ADHD bitch. Oh. Because <laughs> the sauce buck just appeared. What's this one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before this, it was saying Verzion doesn't seem to like Terrakion. So I was trying to get it to say it again. Because I saw this. And I was like, oh, that's funny. It's stupid, though. What was this one? Captures I take by accident. So I don't always trust those. But videos... I always take on purpose, so there's always something to these. Oh. <laughs> That size difference was kind of crazy, too. What was this? Oh, that was one I took by accident. I remember taking that by accident. Oh shit, I went offline. Whoops, I forgot that that would happen. Um, yeah, I gotta go back to that now. Oopsie poopsie. Back to the game. Do it. Man, I had people in my stream like right at the beginning when I was first starting up. That was like the slowest point of the stream. I wish there were people here now while I had more energy. it's taken to communicate in a while. Maybe it's because I just had to reconnect.
Oh, come on, man. What the hell? Oh, sick. That was a nice little clutch up on the timer. Let's do it. Ooh. Sneeze alert, clef key. At least I think it would. Yeah. Let's go. I think the Passimian would be the next best thing because it has Rock Tomb. What the fu- uh, Am I psychic or something? Actually, now that I'm rethinking it, would the weakness to fire... Dude, so many of us were, are gonna get... Well, not so many, but two of us are gonna get slaughtered by that carpal. Okay. That's unfortunate. Looks like I'm not psychic, actually. I'm about to get shafted by this thing. Yeah, the Passinian is going to be linked to the flying, and I don't know if that's worth the super effective move, especially since it's a very mediocre super effective move. I don't know if it's worth it for me to Dynamax. I don't think it's good if I Dynamax if I'm like a shit Pokemon, because it's it, I kind of feel like I'm wasting it, you know? Even though it would help. Oh, dope. Oh, not as dope. I forgot the hits everywhere. Oh, nice! Big hit. Yeah, the Sneasel feels the same way, I guess. Yeah. Cool. Let's go. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I think our best bet would be the. Yeah, for sure. Especially since there's the scientist on the line. So, whoever wants to change can. Why did the... Why? Well, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully it's a Gigantamax, at least. Not just a 
regular ass. But it suck. I thought its eyes just started glowing red, like entirely. Like even the sockets. It, that's what it looked like. That honestly would be dope. Alright, let's, let's, oh, he's got Ash's hat, that's cool. Let's see if this is <laughs> Gigantamax. Okay, good, it is. That would have been really fucked if it wasn't <laughs> Gigantamax. And that scientist just gave this guy a, a regular ass Butterfree. Okay, it's pretty alright damage. That's good damage. Haha. <laughs> he made the same mistake I did, like, and I'm over there. Why that? I keep thinking ice resists more than it does. Ice should be a better type than it is. I've been thinking of trying to look into ROM making, because I feel like that'd be cool. Oh no, now steel, steel roller's gonna work. What the? Why did it? What? Um. Yeah, if I ever do act on that, which I probably won't, because I always say, like, oh, I wanna do X project. It never happens. But I would definitely change some things, like change types around, change how some types work. Like, I would make ice resist more than just itself. Like, crazy thought, but... Maybe ice should be a better type. Or, the ice type should be applied to better Pokemon. Because it's a glass cannon type. And yet most of them are built to be slow and bulky. Why? I have no fucking clue. Continue on. Who the fuck? I think this would be the best bet. Yeah? No. Yeah, actually, yeah. Because I resist the poison. And the grass, I think. Yeah, he's good on grass. Carcolm might have a ground move. I already forgot what the fourth Pokemon was. Because it went away. And I have no object permanence. Yeah, I 
Oh nice, we're still going. Hey. We're not getting shot like usual. It's not as dramatic the fucking tenth time you do it. I keep wanting to say some cringe shit like, oh, it's the final showdown. It's like, no, it's not. I know I'm gonna do this again. I like how Cleft Key has stayed in every single game after Gen 6. Isn't that nice? screen should be priority moves. Or maybe they are and Karkol just has terrible speed, which would wouldn't make sense because it's a minecart. But then again, Vikerbolt's speed is terrible even though in its dex entry it says how fast it is. Like it emphasizes it. And also it's super fast in the auto battling and Scarlet and Violet. But what are you gonna do? Maybe it just takes long to charge up his attacks, I don't know. I never noticed that detail. I never looked at it that closely. The stars like sink into the ground and the little beams come up. That looks kind of cool. Is it gonna get in the ball? Yippee! Wow, Discord didn't even pick that up. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'll take this for the funny. I guess.
Oh, nice. Usually good. It's a good noise. Um, either one, honestly, but I do want Ivy Sore. If I don't get that's shiny. His body slam super effective. I feel like that Arcanine shirt is like the Pokemon equivalent of like the Wolves Howling, Howling at the Moon shirt. It gives that kind of vibe. Like people that think they're way cooler than they are wear that shirt. Either that or people who want to be funny. Oh god. I am so very sorry. What move? Did it have like Zen Headbutt or something? I forget that, like, regular Basculin is actually kinda good. I caught a shiny Basculin, and I am ashamed to admit this. This isn't Scarlet Violet. But I figured that I was never gonna use it, and since I have such, like, consistently good shiny luck, um... I like to be charitable with my extra shinies. Like, if I get a duplicate shiny, I like to wonder for it. Just cuz. So I did that with the shiny Basculin I got, thinking, oh, I'm gonna have a shiny Basculegion at some point. A little did I know that shiny Basculin... Er, not shiny Basculin specifically, but like regular... What is Basculin? Gen 2? Regular Jotonian Basculin is, like, actually good. I forget what Gen Basculin is, though. Actually, it might be Gen 4. I don't remember. I honestly do not know. I forbore. What Pokemon did it have? Haunter? Yeah, I guess there is more coverage there. Hmm... I see a uh, I see a cute one. Because three of us are good on it, but one of us is weak to it. Mm. 
Yeah, okay. I'll take the shovel. Nice. Okay. Sorry, I forgot I was streaming. I was like, I just got quiet. Why am I quiet? My gamer brain made me lock in. You know, I don't need to. I don't know why, but like, just now specifically, my brain is like, time to get serious. <laughs> Oh, so redeem. Oh my god! What the fuck did he use? I looked down for one second and I died! Oh great, that'll help. Actually, I don't think so. I think I fainted already. Yeah, I definitely have during this dream. Oh, nice. I don't know if they're using physical or special attacks. But at least it's something. Oh, okay, well that helped. Was this the second or the third one? Easy chat, it's too easy. <laughs> Bone meringue? That's so stupid. That shell bell did nothing to help me. I should have taken that focus sash. Is my stream good? Okay, cool. Every so often, my stream looks like it's gonna disconnect. That's a Lyron, I think. It's Dragon type. People are probably going for this. Yeah. I'll just agree with the group. Even though I would have preferred Dragon. I didn't even see what it was. Stream is the shiny that I already have. I'll use Thunder Wave, I guess.
I'm not doing this good. So this, I'm not doing so good this time around. God! I like that my character just hit like a really gay pose for a second. I wish you had the option of setting all of the animations. Um, no, okay. okay, I was gonna say, I hope it gets to keep the item. I wish they added an option that was like... If you want to, you can change the the animation of the Dynamax battle so that all of them are the shorter one. That would be a nice hotfix. It's not like they're going to go back and update this more five-year-old game. But honestly, they would update this before they <laughs> update Scarlet and Violet to look half as good as this. Pokemon and Scarlet might look phenomenal. Everything else looks like shit. Oh, that really sucks. At least we get the lowering of the... Oh, wow. Are we gonna bring it back, boys? Are we gonna bring it back? You know what? I'm gonna be flashy. Does Aurora's have an ability that... I'm actually, I'm gonna look this up. Because I genuinely am really curious. Oh my god, wait. This is actually really bad. Is it the third or the fourth? Okay, it's the third. Please tell me this actually hits. Yeah, it does turn it ice tight. Okay, cool. Great. Multi move becomes ice tight. Yeah, it does have a move that turns the multi moves to ice tight. That's cool. I did not know it had that. Ah! I almost dropped my controller. Oh my god, it's almost been four hours. More than doubled the time that I would have streamed for if I stopped when I was going to originally. Look at that. Look 
Let's see if we get a shiny this time, because I don't know how much longer I actually want to do this. Because I might actually leave soon, because it's 11.30 p.m. currently my time. Okay, I think I'm gonna do one more. And then I'm gonna switch over to Scarlet and Violet for a little bit. Actually, I think I'm gonna do that now. We're gonna take a little pit stop in Scarlet and Violet to see, like, remember that, um, the video of me in the Beldum outbreak. I think I want to go and do that. Let me say I'd have to change this the category. It is only going to be for a little bit longer, but still, it's important. Okay. Stream category has been changed. And then after I finish hunting in the Beldum, whether I get a one shiny or if I run out of time because the it hits midnight and the raids change, I will do a Deli Bird raid. Is it Saturday or Sunday? I think it's Saturday. So I think they should still be going on even if I do go online. So I could if I really wanted to. But I don't know if I want to. Because I usually like doing raids solo and just cheesing it with whatever strategy Austin John Plays comes up with. Or Blaine's. Either or. And sometimes the Cyrus if I'm feeling spicy. But I don't wash him as often. Austin John is usually my go-to. With my favorite game being Pokemon, you could also assume that one of my favorite genres of YouTube is PokeTubers. I just think they're neat. Oh, so the monkey. Ah, it's nice to take a little break and not have to worry about battling. Just riding around on my penis dinosaur. What is? chill winter music in the background chill beats to relax slash study to I don't even want to think about anything academic right now it's Christmas time just a week away I keep thinking the glare the glare keeps making them look silver So I don't know what it's going to look like if I actually do see a shiny in the wild. And taking a break from the, the max raids, I am actually getting some energy back. I think I just needed a change of pace. Instead of the monotonous grinding, now I'm just monotonously walking around in circles. But at least I'm in somewhere different. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Oops. Excuse me. Is that...
Hello? What the fuck? Where did you come from? Sick. Alright, well, at least I have a recording of me finding a singular shiny on stream. Also, that was full odds, too. I mean, with the shiny charm, but still. Let me see what box that went into. I want to make sure that it went into the box that I want it to. Okay, good. It did. Like, because of how insane this game's shiny odds are and how much the shiny gods have spoiled me with them, I don't even have good reactions to fucking shiny Pokemon and Scarlet Violet that much anymore. I wish I did. It would make for better content. Because most, mostly now I'm just kind of flabbergasted. Like, you hear the way that I pause, it's just like, is that... What the fuck? <laughs> if I remember and or feel like it, I'll show the collection of shinies that I've accrued. Because I have a bo I have, like, boxes of Pokemon that I would like- that I either use for raids actively or would like to use for raids. Or just want to level up because I feel like it. Most of them- well, not most of them, but, like, a good chunk of them are shinies. And a lot of the times I will just put them in that category because they are shiny. And I want to see them get leveled up and have better moves so that I could possibly use them in the future because I like using shiny Pokemon. I mean, like, what Pokemon fan doesn't? Even if they're bad shinies, it is still nice to use a shiny Pokemon. Like, it feels cool. Something a little different. Something rare, you know? Also, the reason that I haven't, been, like, set up anything is because I got the 60 KOs earlier today while I was doing it. And I don't like using sandwiches with outbreaks. Like, it does help. And I have used sandwiches with outbreaks before. But, like, if it's one that I didn't expect. Or, like, not, or one that I wasn't actively looking for a shiny of. Like, a lot of the time, I don't need... Urban Mystica to find shinies from Outbreaks. So I just started not using them. And yeah, it takes longer, but I play this game for hours and hours a day because I have no other life outside of school. So it works out. <laughs> Plus, if I miss one, it'll make for funny. So that's a plus in a backwards way. Because I've never noticed if I've missed a shiny or not. Like, I've failed shinies before. I've just, like, if I ever miss one, it's because I don't notice it. And I wouldn't know if I didn't notice it because I didn't fucking notice it. Shiny, the shiny Metagross line is just one of those shinies, though, which is why I'm doing it. It's like, it's, it's one of those, like the ones where like you see it and you're like, yeah, that's fucking cool. You know, it's like one of the ones that everyone thinks is good, like that unanimous, unanimously, like without a doubt is like a really good shiny. So that's why I decided to try and take advantage of this, even if I'm not really trying that hard. It's still something to do. Gives me more things to stream.
love the way they stylize the music in the Indigo disc. Because, like, it really, really sounds like it could be from Gen 5. And I love it. And that's another thing that Pokemon fans unanimously agree on. Gen 5 music, banger. Oh shit, whoops. It is weird to see Beldum stand up like that. It's like seeing a cat stand up on its hind legs when it's like... ...startled by something. Like, what the fuck? It sucks that I wanted to do this around Christmas time, though, because, like, everyone's doing things. So I can't really get it. I want to be on stream with me. And I wish I could. Because, like I said before, I work a lot better with people. But I am really good at talking to myself, so either way it works out, but I just like having that companionship, you know? It's a nice bonding experience. Plus, I just like laughing with friends. I hate the scuffed lighting in this game. Some of them just look actually brighter than others, for no reason. Like, that wouldn't- like, what the fuck? Like, right? Like... You aren't shiny, right? No. But you look like you're an entirely different shade... ...of blue. And I know that sh the shiny Beldum line is silver, but even then, when you're far away and they're angled differently, they look like they could be silver. So it makes me wonder if I would catch a shiny one, depending on what angle it's at. But I've seen shiny Metagross in this game. This looks sick. A lot of the Pokemon they brought back in Indigo Disc and in um, Teal Mask. I'm so glad that they did. I missed them. Especially Levani. I'm glad Levani and Zep Striker are finally on the Switch. And they look great in this game. Flygon looks really good in this game too. When I first saw it, I was like, holy shit, I have to use this on a team. Even the, 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 it happens to Matang, too. The glare just makes them look an entirely different color. And I get it's the metal texturing, too. It's a nice detail, but it's annoying. I was going to say I shouldn't be complaining so much, but complaining to myself is most of the talking to myself that I do, so I probably wouldn't be saying nearly as much if I wasn't complaining. So while annoying, at least I can fill the dead space. God 
Damn it, I thought that was one. Alolan Sandshrew is one that I want to get to. I said this way earlier in the stream, but Alolan Sandshrew is one of my favorite shinies, even though it is just a darker blue. I think it looks nice. And also just one of my favorite Pokemon in general. I like its design a lot. And its typing is cool. And it can actually work as a glass cannon. But the steel type does help with the defensive side. It resists more things, though it does make it four times a week to fighting and fire. It's worth it to me, though. Maybe that's just because I have a bias, though. I'll use any Pokemon that I like, no matter how good or bad it is. Like, I'd have a Clef Key on my team if I'd found it earlier. Because it spawns near the Psychic Gym, and that's a later gym. And also, there are better Steel and Fairy types, obviously. But it'd be funny, you know? Like, on a separate playthrough, I might actually use a Clef Key. Just because I think it's funny. left before this outbreak resets. So I hope I can find one in that time. It is weird hearing switch sound be stereo in my headphones. No. God damn it, I thought that was one. That one looked like especially different, but it was just because of the angle it was that, of course. There was one over here that looked really silver too, that like literally just despawned before I started coming over, so I really hope that wasn't a shiny. But knowing my luck, it probably was. Isn't this such exciting content? Just watching me sit here and wait. I really thought I was going to end the stream a lot earlier. I'm glad I had that second wind. Because even though I am doing really mellow and boring shit, it's been fun. I'm starting to get back into the, the groove, the mindset of content creation. Who knows, maybe I'll actually finish another song. That's unheard of. Damn, this game's lighting. Why?
Ah. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to say before. L just a little fun fact. That Blaziken is one of uh, my starters from one of my old original playthroughs of one of my first Pokemon games. And also, part of the reason why Blaziken is my favorite Pokemon. Because it's one of my earliest starters, and I have a lot of attachment to it. I forget how it became my favorite, because I feel like it was my favorite before I started playing a lot more with it. But I don't see how else I would have gotten into it. I know partly it was also because of Jane Animations, because she likes Torchic, I have Blaziken. I remember that. Everyone thought she liked Torchic because she put Torchic a lot in her videos. But if her real favorite Pokemon is Blaziken. That's just a stupid thing to remember, but... I do. I am really glad I at least got that shiny Crip Rawler on recording. While I was playing Sword and Shield, I thought of that. I don't know why Crabominable came into my mind, but it did at some point. And I was like, shiny Crabominable is also good. I might hunt for that. Well, Crabominable is ugly as fuck, but like... It's shiny form compared to its regular form. It has a good shiny. I think, at least. The blue to red is a nice color swap. And then, one of the first things I see when I boot this up for stream... That little fucker. I'm either going to name it Mr. Krabs or Bandit. Because it's a red-handed crab. I feel like that's pretty self-explanatory why I would do that. I... What the fuck? I... Just like held my V button and it did not jump. I really hope my controller's not starting to go weird. Okay, cool. It just didn't respond to that one time for some reason. Maybe because of the terrain that I was on when I pressed it? I don't know. I just had a fiasco with my Joy Cons. Like, when it was like my newest pair of Joy Cons started getting drift, like. A month or two after I'd gotten them. And they were a Christmas present too. Like a limited edition. Like the limited edition Scarlet Violet set of Joy-Cons. I was pissed. So that was like my final straw. And I like submitted all of the Joy-Cons that have gotten drift over the years. And have just gotten crummy because they were old. For repair. And like the ones that I'm using are the one pair that I didn't. Because they're the one pair that have been working so consistently for as long as I've had them. So I was going to be pissed if this pair now started having problems right after I just got done fixing the problems with all my other ones. But at least Joy-Con repairs are free. That is nice. It is a nice thing. It is a nice thing to have as the one thing that Nintendo isn't 
like money grubby about. I've got four minutes. Has anything that's ever happened to you, like, having deodorant on, and then over time, like, if you have your arms open for a while, like, if you're holding a controller like I am, for some reason it starts to drip? Like, it liquefies and drips down your fucking side? Has that happened to you guys? Anyone who's watching this? I hope that that's something that people can relate to, because it's the most annoying thing ever, and it happens to me a lot when I'm playing games. Especially, like, when I'm at my desk like this. With my stream set up. I hate it. I just hate the sensation of being wet, in general. Except if I'm, like, actively in water. Like, the pool or the shower. But outside of water, I hate the sensation of being wet. I don't know why. Not all the time. Sometimes it can feel good if I just got out of something hot. And then the air makes you feel cold. And it's like, ooh, nice. Uh, uh. I panicked. <laughs> they were surrounding me. This is a weird thing that I've noticed over time. My, me, for me talking so much, so suddenly after me basically doing nothing for the past week, the vibration of my vocal cords in my body is making me feel like the like a bit nauseous. I don't know why that's happening, but it is. And I just felt like that needed to be said. I don't know why, but it's like it, it's confusing me. Like, my body, for some reason, has become hyper-aware of the vibration of my vocal cords. And is now making me feel kind of weird. I don't know if that's something that has happened to people before. Like, the other thing I was talking about. I, maybe I'm just making myself look extremely peculiar. But I know I am already, so that wouldn't... I mean, that kind of tracks, so. I've got less than a minute... So I'll just, I'll sit here and see. I didn't... Oh. Yep, there it goes. One last look to see if one spawned while I wasn't looking. And that's all she wrote. <sighs> Alright. Well, that last 20 minutes was for nothing. Not completely get that one other one, but it was really early on. Past to that. Like, nothing fucking happened. But I wonder what this is. It's one that I don't have in my decks yet. So I guess I'll go check this out for a little bit, and then I'll look at the Iron Bundle Dynamax Raids. Get one of those in before it goes away. 
Is it here or is it above this? Oh, it's Minior! But it's a specific color of Minior. This would be a nightmare to hunt. Because the outside of them doesn't change. It's only the inside of it that changes. So you'd have to wait for them to do like their form change thing. Or catch them. Shell Smash broke them out of their shell. I forget what breaks them out of their shell in battle. Oh, come on, get their fucking crit capture. is a lot quieter than the sword shield was. In terms of the sound effects at least. I am really scared to see how my sound balanced when I'm done streaming. Thank Christ! Finally! I wish in the updated, oh, it's red core. I wish in the updated, um, or upgraded rather, the upgraded, like, zoom feature showed if they were shiny. Because that would be much nicer. Also, what the- why the fuck does Joltik move like that? What the hell? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Where is there a Delibird? Bird? Right. Is it in Red Newer Paldea? What type was it? Water? Ice. I'm gonna go to Montenevera. Because I, I think I'm gonna have to build a new Pokemon competitively, and this is where I buy all of my competitive items. And also the hyper training guy is here. Uh, another little intermission. So, see you in a little bit while I steal Lost in John's strategy.
Well, I'm back again. Um, for anyone who could have somehow possibly watched this part of the stream. Oh god. My stream's cutting out again. It says excellent connection. Okay, everything's fine. Um, my lovely friend Kaito came to the stream while I was on my BRB screen and said, and I quote, L stream TBH didn't put B Arby's like the restaurant Arby's. Just BRB, loud and correct buzzer. Thank you for that input. Very much appreciated. And will be noted for the future. Now, for this raid, I've gotten a little something special. Because the best strategy seems to be Magirna. Now, this is definitely a legit Magirna. If anyone asks, this is a legitimate Magirna. Definitely not hacked in. Totally legit. Sun and Moon. QR code Magirna. Not one that I just got transferred in here from a Blaine's video. Because it's an event Pokemon, and I usually keep hacked event Pokemon. Which I don't, by the way. That was a joke. Nintendo, that was a joke. I never keep hacked Pokemon. I always release them, because that's the right thing to do. But as a joke, this is not real, this is a hypothetical. If I did keep hacked Pokemon, I would keep the hacked event Pokemon because it's not like you would be getting them a different way anyway. It's not like you'd have to work for them. You just have to be somewhere or put a code in and then you get it. The only difference is you're not putting in a code. You're just putting it in your game. So it's not like you're cheating. It's just like you missed it or something. But, of course, I would never partake in such things, because I'm a Puritan, and would never keep hacked Pokemon. Don't mind that original trainer, actually. D yeah, don't don't look at that. Now... Hey, 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 hey! Get out of here! I thought you were gone! Get the fuck out of here! Oh, I was. Can't stand you. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Really appreciate that. Apparently, the strategy is... Modest Magirna pumped into special attack in HP with supplements, like usual. No problem, at least I could do? Of course. You always got my back. What the fu- Oh, this is the deli bird that I had. And then... Brick Break for the Aurora Veil. And... Flash Cannon for big damage. And then you win. Apparently. Sure, why not? And again, this is definitely legit. This Pokemon is never legit. And I would never keep hacked Pokemon. Don't mind that original trainer name. I would never, ever keep hacked Pokemon. Never in my life. 
So let's set this thing up and fuck up that deli bird. Wow, it knows zero fucking moves. All right. Let's level this thing up. What's with the nerd speech? Just get to the game. Fuck off. I like talking into the void. Don't tell me how to stream. I already know that I'm bad at it. Is its signature move. So I'll put it on there just because. Actually, where was the user special attack? Oh, it's special. Oh, it sucks. <laughs> its signature move sucks. Why would anyone use that ever? Do I have a modest mint or do I need to buy one? That's the wrong tab. I need to buy one. Okay. I'm also probably going to need to buy supplements, but it's fine. I think I have shmoney. I have some shmoney. Not much, but some. I have enough to buy the supplements that I need. Kaito, I know where you live. I'm gonna come over there and smack the shit out of you. I think... Am I... Do I know math? Yes, I do know math. I have acknowledged many times that the stream is probably very boring. Boring? Boring. <laughs> nice. Um, but Pokemon's one of my favorite games. So. Boring. Hey, I was self-aware, so... That makes it okay. That's how it works. I don't make their rules. got fucking <laughs> deleted by Nightbot, which is the bot that you suggested I link to my account. You did that to yourself, my boy. Sit down, little bro. Sit down, little bro. special defense. Do I have those? I do. At least you're getting my chat rate up. That's nice. I'm focusing too much on you fucking with me and not on the game. So now I'm like my my attention is shifting too much and I'm fucking up what I'm doing. Do you learn Calm Mind by nature? Nope. Do you learn Nasty Plot? I don't think so. Do you learn Moon Blast? You learn Misty Explosion. That's kind of cool. You learn Dido and Lean. Player of. Ah. 
I ain't gonna need Brick Break, though. No, not the... Ah, I keep pressing the wrong tabs. boring things to do before I get to the battle. Yippee, this is... This is good content for streaming. Uh, yeah. It does, this is the rubbery that breaks barriers. is pretty cool. I forgot that was a new move. I don't have Moonblast as a TM. Shit. <laughs> Alright, I'd have to teach it to Asimund Lane, which is fine, but still, I would rather teach it Moonblast. I forget. Do you learn Dazzling Gleam by nature? No, I need to teach it to you. I'm mean, going to keep you Steel Beam for now, because that apparently is also a good thing to use. For, like, huge damage. Like a one-and-done kind of thing. Though I forget what Steel Beam does. It damages you. That's right. Um, and its ability is also really good, so, like, every time your AI companions faint, Soul Heart activates... What are your IVs? Let's see. That's the wrong button. Three are bad. Three, uh -huh. Three of your IVs are good. Two of which I actually do need. How many bottle caps do I have? I love my 6 IV definitely legit Magirna. That guy just disappeared. Okay. See, it's totally real. It's from the Alola region, see? Um, and I think that's it. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. The Shell Bell. So, this would be nice. Just in case. Uh, hmm. I almost forgot what I was doing again. Do I have a spare, or am I going to need to buy another one? I do have a spare. Great. Let's see. It's so nice being able to finally actually fly like this in a Pokemon game. It's so nice to just get over the mountains and the, the cliffs and the water without having to stop. That's the wrong raid. 
I just saw the beam and I was like, oh, that's probably the one I'm going to, without looking at the fucking mini map. <sighs> Where is the thing? How far away is it? I should have just fast traveled. Why didn't I fast travel? <sighs> it's getting late, man. It's 12.38 a.m. I'm starting to lose the boost from the caffeine that I had. I'm talking less. I'm not as confident in myself anymore. I need to get this over with so I can end stream soon. <laughs> this sucks. This stream sucks. This is such a sucky comeback stream. Comeback like I'm actually coming back to a fan base. I wish I was. It'd be so nice to have a chat that I could goof off with. All I've got is Kaito, who dogs on me for being boring. And I can't even say anything. Because I am. Let's see if this shit works. At least I get to listen to the raid music. I do genuinely like McGearna. McGearna's really cute. In real talk, it is kind of cool that they just let you have uh, Mythical with a QR code, and you can still get it today if you have Sun and Moon and you beat it. It's really cool. So I'm gonna use Brick Bait. Oh, that's not cool. Oh my god. My health is really fucking low. Which is very not good. I'm really out of it right now. I'm not even like registering anything that's happening on the screen right now. Still got the special boost. That's So far, so okay. I'm not gonna say good. I'm just gonna say okay. Oh my god, what the? Oh, Alright! It's a lot of boosts! <laughs> oh, my Terra. It's ready! Yippee! damage. I like that. I like that very much. Imagine if Brick Breaker worked on those. Stat changes. Fuck you. Electric drain. Fuck you. Oh, that's what restored my health. The life do. Quark drive? Oh, you... Ah. Uh, is no, not the move info. The status. Is there a roar veil up right now? No. Okay, so I'll just keep using flash cannon. Oh, that's a lot of damage. And that's not enough damage. Oh, that's not enough for me, Jan, either. At least the AI sucks at this game. And I keep getting random boosts to my special attack because of Magirna's broken ass ability.
Oh, if it hits another Hydro Pump, I'm actually dead. That wasn't enough regen to cover. Oh! The AI with the life dew coming in clutch! Hopefully. Unless it crits. Okay. Cool. I love how fucking buggy this raid system is. She doesn't even register until like a good 10 seconds after it happens. Ah! <laughs> oh! Ah, oh, okay. Is this it, or am I gonna have to go through one more turn? Is that it? Did it, did it happen? Did it work? Is that... Did I eat the Cheerios? Did I eat Cheerios? Yes. I did, in fact, eat the Cheerios. What should I catch you in? I'm gonna catch you in a sport ball, because you're an event for the new update. And this is a ball from the new update. And it fits your color scheme. And just like that, after a series of boring events, I finally got a shiny. And I completed the new raid event. Definitely legitimately, and not with a hacked Pokemon. Real talk though, I it does it really doesn't matter. You get it with a fucking QR code, or you get like if you're gonna hack in any Pokemon, it's gonna be event Pokemon. And I'm pretty sure I got that fucking like wonder traded to me. No, I didn't. It's from a Blaine's video. I do remember getting a Magirna Wonder traded to me in like Ultra Sun Ultra Moon when I played that. Which was really funny. Send them to the boxes. But no, like... <laughs> I mean, what am I saying? Of course it's real. I must be joking. I would never do such a thing. Why would I hack in a Pokemon that I could just get so easily from a game that I have and have completed? Why would I ever do that? This ain't hacked, though. For sure. Look at that. Hoan Champion. That's my boy. That's the OG right there. Dr. Bust Down. Show some respect. That's my boy right there. I was pressing the wrong button. <clears throat> anyway. I'm gonna get this little guy over to my boxes. This is the, these boxes are the collection of Pokemon that I like to use in raids. So I, t like, I have many of them. It started with the original Charizard raid. This is the OG. The mightiest Mark Charizard. God, they redid the models so fucking well. If you know why he's named Pancakes, I have some extra respect for you. Because I didn't even know what that reference would have been until I met the person I did this raid with. And the last thing I was going to do was look for Herba Mystica. Should I do that? Why the fuck not? Ian's playing Fortnite, let's go! I'll do a little bit more. Just a wee bit more. Just a wee bit more. I have a screenshot from a video that I watched of the Pokemon that drop Herba Mystica most commonly in five-star raids. So I will be looking for those. It's not five star.
let me just go from my map instead of walking around aimlessly. Did they change this music or did I just never notice that music before? Is it just because I'm wearing headphones this time? But there were instruments and details in that music that I'd never heard before, ever. And I've been playing this game for like a year. Straight. That's five star. Is that one of the Pokemon that gives extra shit? No. Lycan Rock was a lot lighter than I'm used to it being. And even though it's not at all what the shiny looks like, I was like, is that? Because I'm just hard coded. Whenever I see a slightly different color, I'm like, shiny? But this game's visuals just kind of suck. Get out of here. Three star pin curtain. A -psh! A -psh! Get that low level shit out of here. five stars. Right, not one of the Pokemon. Watch, I'm being so picky right now, and then when I actually find one of the one of the Pokemon that drops Urban Mystica more commonly, I'm not gonna get any. <laughs> and there will have been no point for me searching this. Um, the word I'm looking for. Searching this strictly. No. Nar. Oh right, I forgot I'm in the lag tree thicket. God, this game runs like ass. Booty cheeks, I say. Whenever I play this game, it's going to be a mix of me praising it to high hell because of how much I cherish this game and its story and dogging on how fucking shitty it can be. Grinding on the Deli Bird outbreaks is also something that I want to do because the Deli Bird parcels are apparently really good for the Pokeball Waddle from the new Indigo Disc update. So I might stock up on those too. Plus, the shiny odds are like insane on those. Um, outbreaks. Like, way lower than they should be. Not saying it's a bad thing. I like me some shinies. But, like, it's become a lot, a lot, a lot easier to get shinies over the years. That noise usually means I'm unsatisfied with my current situation. So you can assume that it was probably directed at the fact that I did not get the raid that I wanted to. Just a little 
quick course on my unique little language that I've developed over my years as a neurodivergent child. Like, look, are you kidding me? Look at the tiling. I could do better than, I could do better than that with the game design classes that I've taken. And I'm not even being facetious. I'm being so dead ass. I could do better than that with the game design classes that I've taken. Inexcusable. I still love this game though. Blissey raids are more common? There's a Blissey raid event going on right now. Is it possible for the event raids to drop our bonus to go? Because I don't think it is, but if it is, then I'm just being really dumb. But I don't think it is. Every raid event that I've done, I've never, not once, gotten a bonus to confirm. I did not touch you. either. Nope. These are a lot of cool raids, though. I am passing up some good shit. But I am looking for a very specific item. Not even just Urban Mystic in general. Like, I want a specific kind. Because the only teacher I have left to fully befriend is the home ec teacher. Um, and apparently you need to get a sweet Herba Mystica for him just to complete the goddamn quest. And not even just any, specifically the sweet one. And it's already hard to get one in general, because you have to look for all the five-star raids and it takes so long to do them sometimes. And most of the time you don't even get any. And then even if you do get one, it... There's, it can be like one of five. And not every kind of raid drops every kind of Urban Mystica. It depends on what Pokemon it is that you're fighting. So there's like way too many variables in this. That like, looking up a guide is the easiest thing I can do, even if it seems more monotonous than what I could be doing, which is battling and actually playing the game in a more entertaining fashion. But most Pokemon streamers do shit like this too. And just talking to the void like I am. But most Pokemon streamers actually have an audience to talk to. So that's probably why my stream isn't going as well. But I shouldn't be complaining as much because the reason I stream is because all I do in my free time is play games and talk to myself. And if I can create things and put it out to the world while just doing things that I like, then I'm going to do it. That's not one either, but it is a cool raid, especially since it's Fire Terra. Those gas look weird in this light. Genuinely though, I do like streaming. 
even on the off chance that like one person has seen this, like it's, I I, I feel nice. Like oh, someone clicked on me and watched me for like five seconds. I helped alleviate someone's boredom for like one millionth of their day. Cool. Baxcalibur? Did I check this one already? I don't remember. I'm gonna check it again right here, so. If I did, then I'm just gonna look stupid. See what this one is if they haven't already gotten it. I could fast travel, but I like flying. Plus, it gives me more buffer time to just sit here and do nothing. Because it's something I like to do a lot. Just sitting around and doing nothing. One of my favorite activities. What I'm doing right now. No, I don't want no goddamn gum shoes. I really shouldn't be streaming anymore, but I am. This is barely content anymore. It was before, but like even now, it's barely content. I just keep talking about how bad my content is and repeating that same point over and over and repeating the point of me making that point, trying to be meta over and over and over. It's a cycle. It's a never-ending cycle. Late. I'm also especially so. I, I'm sorry to keep talking about the fucking perch and stuff. Anyone who's watching this, like, yeah. This is like a therapy session. It's also another reason why I like doing this. I can just vent and feel like I'm actually being received by someone, even if I'm not. And dogging me for this stream, actually. It's <laughs> starting making me overthink it again. Like, hee hee ha ha joke, self deprecation, but like. It's hard, man. I don't want to do this no more.
Cartoon characters when they take a shower. I just got so immediately fed up. It just like built up inside so fast and had to come out. Like it was just like I had this like primal urge. <laughs> so fucking weird. I really should go to bed. Get up the goddamn mountain! This is so boring. I'm literally looking around the entire map of Paltea. How is this content? It's not. Stop talking about being self-conscious about your content. Talk about something fucking else. Uh, we'll be whatever we're having. I don't like that the first thing that came into my mind to fill space with while I was flying was a 9-11 joke. Oh, the, what the fuck? <laughs> Hello? Where the hell did you come from? I, I did not know that this was the spot where you find Moltres. I, it, I just happened to be flying over this spot. I haven't gotten any of the legendaries yet. I guess I'm just doing this now. Impromptu legendary fight. I I swear to god, I did not I did not know that this was here. Purely by accident. Oh man. That would have been funny. I wish I had my false swiper with me. I should have changed <laughs> I should have changed my team before I did this. I don't want to use Thunder Punch because I might actually kill it. I will Terra Blaze kick it though. Because it will half the damage. It will two times and half the damage. So why did I even Terra? That just brings it back down to one times. It 
I literally just did nothing for myself. Oh my god. Actually, no. I'm wrong. It does actually help. Please excuse my botched mental math. Oh yeah, bust down. That's my boy. Another dust ball. That one didn't even shake. No, he didn't even shake. Yeah, he could go. No. We're done with the shake. to wait a turn. Oh, I don't. Oh. Well. Sorry, Dr. Bustdown. I should have healed you. That's my bad. Uh... You will resist it. I bet you can't guess why I named my purple dinosaur Barney. Very complex reasoning. currently in physical pain and still doing this. That's probably why I get, I'm getting so fed up, because I'm also in, like, actual physical pain. Because I've been trying to focus on being entertaining for too long. GET IN THE GOD DAMN BALL! Legendary Pit Stop wasn't a waste of time. isn't calling back to me as it usually does. I am hollow and alone. And yet 
Perhaps the Pokemon still compels me. I am bound to it. What's it event rate? A connection never to be severed. A burden never to be lifted. I'm excited for Christmas. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Gulp of these nuts. That'll wake you up. That's one way to wake up. Again, you get some respect points from me if you know where that's from. And also some disrespect points. If you knew where that's from, you'd know why. I've been thinking about getting the shiny gulpin. Because I see them around a lot, but I never actually commit. But here he is. The little boy. I'll put it up here. Because I want to section off the legendary birds. Can I at least get one raid of the thing that I'm fucking looking for? No, well, that's too far. I don't feel like going all that way. Alright, this is the last one I'm checking in Paldea, and then I'm switching over to the fucking the terrarium. I've been streaming for almost six hours. If it hits six hours and I'm still doing this, I'm stopping. Because there's literally no point in me doing this anymore. Have I seen this one already? I don't think so, but I've seen that Pokemon already. And it's not one that I need. Okay, I s <laughs> this is the actual last one I'm checking. I forgot that I said the other one was going to be the last one I checked. Oh. Hey, watch out, okay. watch out, okay. Jack! GTA is another game that I want to play on stream. Me and my friends always fuck that shit up. Oh, we used to. I haven't played it in a while. I want to. Okay. I'm going to the terrarium. What rage should I check first? I'll check this one. Only three Pokemon in the Indigo Disc that give those numbers of River Mystica are Lapras, Kingdra, and Malamar. Which makes it easier because I can remember three as opposed to ten. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool.
Man, the only reason I'm doing this is because I didn't, like, I wanted more content other than... God, oh. I wanted more content other than like, just beating that raid and leaving in Scarlet Violet before I left it. But if I had gotten that shiny bell bump that I was looking for way earlier, like, was it two hours ago at this point? Jesus Christ. Then I probably wouldn't be doing this right now, and I'd be free of my shackles. I wanted to go to bed earlier. That's- oh my god. <laughs> god, dude, what the hell? Then again, I wouldn't have gotten three shinies full odds today if I didn't keep going, so. This is an extra. I have a shiny Venomoth already. At least I think I do. I'll check for it. That Chansey is tweaking in the background. Did you see that? <laughs> it's still going. <laughs> Look at him. I'm not close enough to you for that. I have a shiny gun moth, don't I? Yeah, it's right there. So I'll put this in the bottom. Yeah, this is also an extra shiny, because I already have one of these. There's a Charmander. You know what? I'm gonna go to the place where it makes sense for there to be a Labrys. Um raid. Where Lapras actually spawns. just had a BP quest that was pick up items. Or did I complete a different one? I don't fucking know, man. Those things are... Just a, a third fucking currency in the game. Because <laughs> we needed those. It is actually kind of nice. Gets you some good shit. So that now I have to grind a third type of thing. Which gives me more of a reason to be needlessly compelled to this game. <laughs> I already forgot the third one. It was Lapras, Kingdra... Malamar. So I'm gonna check here in the coast of mine. And if they're not there, I will... What the... What? Climb the wall! What the f... There's not even enough energy in me to be annoyed at these things anymore. It's just, I, I feel like a disappointed father. Face cam so that I could communicate my expression rather than just sitting here in silence with my little PNG man. Tomorrow you're gonna to wake up, take a nice shower, have some, have an actual breakfast, 
have an actual schedule to your day and do something else other than play Pokemon in your room secluded and feel hollow inside. Okay, me? That sounds like a good idea. That's not the... It's not the... It's... It's... it's that's the... That's not the... Uh, soul has moved on to the afterlife. Why am I still doing this? The stream was going really iffy at first. Then it went to really good after I had that little pick me up. And now I'm just in an existential crisis. How did I get here? Yeah, climb. Climb. It's too late at night for me to be mad. Because I like being vocal when I'm mad. When I'm streaming. Or recording. Because it's fun. But I can't do that. So now I just have to fucking bottle it up. And push it down. And I just... Make, made myself lightheaded, actually. I'm... <laughs> Streaming is actually, like, unhealthy for me, I think. <laughs> I should stream in moderation. <gasps> oh! Oh! That's the one! Alright, I'm doing this, and I'm going to bed. <laughs> oh my fucking god. I'm doing this, and I'm going to bed. Let's get this shit over with. I'm actually sweating. It's winter, and I'm sweating. Well, that's because I've got two heaters right next to me. My actual heater and my computer. And my door's been closed for the past six hours. So it's just been stewing in here. But I'm too self-conscious to put my air conditioner on when it's winter. And also, I live in a rented apartment. So I have to be making my landlord pay for extra electricity. She shouldn't have to be. All because I'm sitting in a... This <laughs> sweaty gamer chair. Like an incel. Because I'm too committed to this stupid game to swallow my pride and leave. Fuck off. Fuck off. Actually, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. <laughs> Breathe. Breathe. Big damage. Big damage. I got that big damage. Always meant to be. Oh, 
Hi! <laughs> Hello! I was not expecting to get new people in my chat this late. You came in at a weird time. How are you doing? I hope your day's been good. Shiny yellow bird? No, I've already got one. Thanks, though. Sure, why not? I'll catch it. I'll put it in a dive ball, no less. You came in at like the last second of my stream. I'm going in. Like, I've been streaming for so long, and it's so late in the day. That I, that I'm having in, like an existential crisis right now, and I was gonna go to bed after this raid. So of course this is the time where I get an actual person to watch my stream. I got a Rumistica. That's all I wanted, and a bottle cap. At least it was something. That's the only thing I was looking for. Wasn't the kind that I needed, but at least I got something. Does it have a mark? Let's see. <laughs> Let me see your summary, please. No! It does not have a mark. Thank you for telling me to check, just to add insult to injury. Want one with a mark? No. <laughs> it's fine. Marks aren't that important to me. All right, that's it. I'm done. <laughs> I was talking about Delibird, a Delibird with a mark. Actually, no. Oh, I just closed the game. I was gonna check to see if the shiny Delibird I have had a mark, but it's too late now. I'm done. I'm done. I'm. <laughs> I'm not gonna stream for like another five months. <laughs> I filled my quota. <laughs> Thank you for coming by. Sorry to leave as soon as you came. <laughs> but I'm tired. <laughs> I will still watch. <laughs> watch what? <laughs> My black screen when I end stream. the past five hours of content, I will, <laughs> I will pay you. I will actually pay you if you make it through that. That would be horrendous. You do not want to sit through the past six hours of content. I assure you. This stream sucked. Oh my god, I stink. Okay, I have to leave. <laughs> I have to separate myself from the world. <laughs> I've slept three hours in the past 30. Please go to bed. Don't suffer the fate that I'm suffering right now. I'm ending my stream. Go to bed. Thank you for coming by. <laughs>